What is up, YouTube? It is Toronto After 77 here once again. Another Jersey review. Uh, before I start, I just want to say that I have a playlist where all my other Jersey reviews are. I'll put the link in the description so you guys can go check all those out. I've done like 20 or 30 Jersey reviews in the past. Uh, so you can check those out. Um, this time it's a special one. Uh, like I've done, I had a couple of these up so far where I've had Milwaukee Bucks jerseys customized and they're all authentic ones. So uh, I just recently got this this year, and I got it customized on, I think, Fanatics. This, they had this, still, this is the Aeroswift version, so this is from, like, the 2017-18 season. Uh, this is their Icon Edition, and uh, Milwaukee Bucks are my favorite team. Um, and, yeah, seven's my favorite number, uh, but let's get into this. Got the Nike logo here. It's, like, a rubberized Nike logo. Um, and then here's the Aeroswift, it says right here, Aeroswift, size 48, uh, large. These are actually run small, so you might want to get a size, size bigger because 48s used to, used to be an extra large, but now with these new Nike ones, uh, 48s are actually a large, so, um, yeah. We got the single stitched Milwaukee across the front with the white and cream got the seven here with the perforations uh single stitched and then uh i got the side panels here which is obviously blue navy i think it's a navy blue i don't know if it's black or navy blue i think it's black um and then we have the green white and cream for cream city milwaukee that's why they have the cream in their colors now uh, fear the deer authentic size 48 at the nike connect still uh, they don't do this anymore, obviously, with the new uh, Vaporknit now. Um, they actually did the Nike Connect with Vaporknit still, but they this year's... Like, I think last year they quit doing it. Um, but yeah, let's turn the jersey over. We got Zelic across the back. Uh, Fanatics surprisingly they didn't they don't do many customized jerseys like they don't have the statement edition that you can customize they don't have um, you know other versions and it sucks that the NBA doesn't make authentics in all the versions of jerseys like City Edition and all that um, I wish they did and I wish they gave you the option to customize you know authentic City Edition or an authentic you know just anything uh, Nike just doesn't it doesn't you know put as much out there as adidas did over the years so yeah we got the rubberized nba logo here um got the one championship bucks one 1971 got zalek single stitched across the back and it's my last name by the way and then we got number seven which is my favorite number uh single stitched with the perforations and then here we got the the venting, you know, for when you sweat and keeps you cooler, I guess, on the court, lighter material. Um, with the, one thing with the, the, the Aeroswift, they changed the vapor in it, obviously, I think you guys know, because the next year, 2018, 19, because jerseys were ripping so easily and it just too light a material and um, vapor in it was just, I guess, was much stronger material for players to wear, you know. But, um, but yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Oh, here's the tags, by the way. Yeah. NBA store. But, uh, yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you enjoy this video. Sorry if it's a little long. Um, but just wanted to get this jersey review up there. So, thank you guys so much for watching again. And I'll see you guys in a future jersey review video. Bye.